Okay, we're just having a, a run through of uh, some of the camera equipment that I use on my camping trips. Um, not all of it gets used at once, don't worry. Um, obviously, I've got a Panasonic 4K camcorder, just a standard type camcorder. It's decent quality, comes out of this. It's, I use this mostly for like your long shots, sort of mountain shots, far off shots. You can add a mic to it as well. Um, I've got the, the mic here, there's an adapter goes in the back. Um, obviously on a tripod, needs to be decent to uh, steady shots for these, otherwise you get too much of that flickering. But uh, yeah, this only gets used, most gets used on dry camps. Obviously I don't want to be taking this out in the wet don't want any of them out in the wet really but this one especially um, so maybe you only get used one out of three camps possibly but it it gets used for other stuff apart from from wild camping trips uh, next up I've got the Canon M50 so this is a mirrorless APC camera again you've got the screen that folds out this is a, a cracking piece of kit. Get a really good picture. Only does 1080, but the 1080 is really pin sharp. Um, and you have the ability to add the mic, which, you know, helps with the wind. Because um, obviously over the times I've been doing this, some of the footage I've got has been, you know, pretty bad upon the summits, and you get poor, poor sound quality. So this doesn't eliminate everything. You know, if it's really, really windy, it'll just distort. Um, but uh, yep, yeah, I love this camera, and I use this normally. I've got a, an adapter on at the moment, but I, you can screw that in. Handheld job, and it's. Uh, It's not too heavy, mid-size sort of mini DSLR. Then we'll go on to my I'll take that off for the moment. Smaller one, Canon G7X Mark III. So if you want to do a really light camp, I usually take that one with us along with me GoPro, which we'll come on to in a minute. But um, yeah, this one's also got the flip-up screen. and is really lightweight, easy to use, obviously all the controls on the back, everything, you can touch screen, which makes life so much easier to go through. And as you've seen before, you can add, you can add a mic, and away you go. Set up like that, simple. And it also is a great little camera on a night time for doing the star shots. Um, you put the camera out, I usually use it with the power bank. And you can power it via the power bank and you can put it out for an hour, two hours, whatever. And it'll uh, take some star shots for you. So yeah, that's a great little camera. I use this little bag here pops in and it clips to your, your rucksack like that. As with all these cameras I always carry spare batteries. So I usually have two for this one, two for the M50, two for the camcorder. I carry two or three for the GoPro because that depending on what weather conditions, temperature conditions, eats batteries. So yeah, we'll go on to now what everybody mostly uses is the uh, the GoPro. This is the the black Hero Seven version. Um, I used to have the attachment with the mic for the mic adapter and use this mic, but I gave up on that. Um, so I just use the uh, the wind muff now. Um, I've added a little 
you know the hot shoe mount and I use for when I'm in the tent or it's dark around camp I just want to get a couple of shots talking to camera or whatever and I can well, if you loosen that and you can just that's it you know so you you're looking to camera and it does a, an okay job but I would say the GoPro is probably used 60% for my uh, camping trips you know added with a little little mini tripod and it works does the job great and obviously if you want to do a time lapse or anything simple but yeah this is, uh, this is normally how I would do my filming with, the, with this one and then I can just pendulum which camera I've got and away we go again and I've also got this is just a an OEX action type camera picked it up for about 25 quid off eBay or something but this is ideal for time lapses I've got another little tripod down there and I'll just set that up you can only get uh, 720 you can't get 1080p on this one but you know it does the job um, I also forgot to mention I've got a, a little Samyang lens now I use this one for the night shots um, goes down to f2 lets a lot of light in got great little camera it's all manual um, it doesn't work automatically you've just set it up uh, auto, uh, manually as I said yeah and then obviously I've got a power bank I've got a couple of power banks that I use different ones I always have these charged up at camps because uh, as you are well aware you do eat a lot of batteries when you're out and about um, so yeah this basically is all of my camera gear for when I go camping I would say majority of the time them two or them two occasionally I'll bring that one and that one and that one depends uh, where I'm going what I'm doing but uh, yeah mostly this and these two or these two which uh, I find they suffice so yeah that's me done so uh, thanks for watching and we'll see you whenever <laughs>